Ritzas Rakerosas. Hello friends, it's me Brizzy, and some of you may not know this, but Game of Thrones is my favorite TV show of all time. So today I thought I'd teach you some useful phrases in High Valyrian as Daenerys Jalmasmo Hentargario Lentrot, Zihobrosio Elos, Torzalti, Mirino Daria, Andalot Serroinaro, Se Elio Valot Daris, Hen Parmenko, Embasma Kalesis. We'll get back to Danny in a second, but first, let's take a minute to talk about today's sponsor. HBO Max! That's right, baby, the incredible streaming platform with something for everyone. And yes, that makes it a nerd like me's paradise. I'm talking a bunch of my favorite DC shows and movies like Birds of Prey and Wonder Woman. I'm talking Doctor Who, the Lord of the Rings trilogy, and yes, every season of Game of Thrones. And if you haven't had the pleasure of diving into Westeros, it is never too late, my friend. If you have any fun playing along with this video and learning some basic Valyrian and pretending to live in a world with dragons, be sure to catch some episodes on HBO Max to keep your Valyrian fresh. Now, back to Daenerys. First, let me give you some pronunciation tips. We're going to breeze through just a couple of things to keep in mind. Every time there's an R sound, give it a little trill. Arr. Anything with a J is a little more like J, so just zhuzh it up a little. The vowel Y can simply be pronounced E, but it's technically meant to be E. So try saying E, but with your lips rounded. E. E. And if that's confusing to you, just forget I said anything. Certain letters have a macron over them, the little straight line. This means you should hold that sound for twice as long. Cecir. Some useful phrases and a little explanation of why they mean what they mean, just so you know what you're saying. Ritzas. Ritzas. Hello. Ritzas derives from the adjective ritza, meaning healthy. Healthy. Ritzas. Gerosilas. Ge. Ros. I. Las. Goodbye comes from the noun geron, meaning path, and the verb ilagon, to lie or to be in a certain place. So it's meant to roughly translate to, may the path lie straight, gerosilas. Daor. Da. Or. No. I don't have any explanation for this, you can't get more basic than no. Daor. Isa. I. Sa. Yes. This comes from the verb sagon, which when put in the present tense is isa, and just means it is. But if you're answering yes about the future, you would say Kesa Gostilus. Gostilus. Please. Derived from the verb costagon, meaning to be able. You're essentially pleading be possible, which I quite like more than the word in the common tongue, please, which I presume is shorthand for if you please, or basically if it's going to make you happy. Be possible adds just such a lovely sense of desperation. Costilus. Kirim vose. Ki rim vo se. Thank you. Which comes from the noun kirim ves, meaning happiness. Kirim vose literally means telling someone to implement joy. Be happy. I suppose it's as if someone does something nice, so you wish them happiness. Kirim vose. Ro ve grior. Ro ve gri or. Excellent comes from the adjective rovegrie, meaning enormous or awesome. Rovegrior. On di hil zalatas. On di hil zalatas. Hit the thumbs up button. <laughs> but really, if this video gets 7,000 likes, I'll make another video of either more Valyrian or an introduction to another fictional language, depending on what's requested most in the comments. This one actually translates to hit the hand, but I think it works. Ondi comes from ondos, meaning hand, and hilzalatas comes from hilagon, meaning to hit. Hit the hand! Ondi hilzalatas! <laughs> I'm sorry, it's shameless, I know. Scoroso gemele, brosa. Scoroso gemele, brosa. What is your name? The root score turns into a bunch of question words involving inanimate things, so like what, when, where, why, how. Scoroso, meaning what. Gemele is a form of gemela, the reflexive form of you. And the verb brosagon means to name, so what do you call yourself? Scoroso gemele, brosa. Sigurino pasmi. 
si cu di no pas mi seven hells <laughs> si cu di comes from si cura meaning seven no pas mi comes from no pasma meaning hell seven hells <laughs> si cu di no pas mi new ha brosi dineris isa new ha brosi dineris isa my name is Daenerys. Nuha meaning my, brosi meaning name, isa meaning is. This one is pretty simple. Nuha brosi Daenerys isa. Skorkidoso glaesa. Skorkidoso glaesa. How are you? Glaesagon means to live. So more literally it translates to how do you live? Skorkidoso glaesa. Siri glaesan. Siri Glaisan. I am well. Or, more literally, I live good. Siri Glaisan. <laughs> Siri Glaisan daur. Siri Glaisan daur. I am not well. Or, I do not live good. Siri Glaisan daur. Skoro sit. Why? With skoro meaning what and sit meaning intended for, basically, what for? Why? Skoro sit. Skoros o tapa. Skoros o tapa. What do you think? Skoros meaning what and o tapa coming from o tapagon meaning to think. What do you think? Skoros o tapa. Zadrizis bustari ixos daior. Nike daineris yelmasmo hen targario lentrot hen valerio webo anagarexan. Valerio munio engos nyuhis isa. Dovogeris! Aixio senatas, mentio senatas, kiloni pilos lue vale tolvia senatas, inurine dore odrigatas, urne drobus daro tolvio belma brigatas. A dragon is not a slave. I am Daenerys Stormborn of House Targaryen, of the blood of old Valyria. Valyrian is my mother tongue. Unsullied! Slay the masters, slay the soldiers, slay every man who holds a whip, but harm no child! Strike the chains off every slave you see. And again, I feel like that one's pretty self explanatory. <laughs> So those are just a few quick and easy phrases for you to pick up and use next time you need to speak High Valyrian. <laughs> Major respect to the language king, David J. Peterson, for inventing such a beautiful and thorough language. I am so sorry that I probably butchered a lot of it, but uh, I just have fun here, right? Thanks again to HBO Max for sponsoring this video. Don't forget that every season of Game of Thrones is available on HBO Max, so you can brush up on your High Valyrian, your Dothraki, your Shy, or even Scoth at any time. And right now you can get 20% off if you prepay for six months, so click the link in my description and don't miss out on all of these incredible shows and movies. I've never done a video even remotely like this before teaching a fictional language, so if you enjoyed it, please hit that thumbs up button because I'm curious how many people are into things like this. And if this video gets 7,000 likes, for the Seven Kingdoms of Westeros of course, I'll make a follow-up video either teaching more Valyrian or maybe even some Dothraki or Elvish? Oh, let me know what you want to see in the comments below and hit the like button. This is the end of the video, so subscribe if you haven't already. You made it this far, you might as well. I'll see you next time with a brand new video. Get us <laughs>